Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti. I am MrPhotographer.com. In this video, I'm going to talk about how you could have images sync between the different Lightroom applications. Specifically, I'm talking about Lightroom Classic. This is the Lightroom that many of us have used for years. This Lightroom is meant to be used on a desktop or laptop computer. Then there's what Adobe is now calling just Lightroom. Many of us call this Lightroom CC or Lightroom Creative Cloud. This Lightroom can also work on a desktop or a laptop, but it also works on mobile devices, smartphones, and tablets as well. Now, you could share images between the two. You could start edits on one and finish edits on the other, but you have to sync those images between these two applications. And that's what we're going to talk about right now. Now, let's get some kind of jargon down because Adobe in their infinite wisdom uses different names for things that are really the same uh, when it comes to these two applications. First of all, in Lightroom itself, uh, you have folders, right? And the folders contain your images. Now you don't sync folders, so you can't sync a folder to Lightroom CC. But down below this, when you're in the library module, you have collections and you have collection sets. These are these ones at the top that kind of look like file boxes. And then you have the actual collections and you could have a number of collections inside of a collection set. Unfortunately, you don't sync collection sets either, but you do sync collections. So you're going to take images or any images that you need to sync, you would put them in a synced collection in Lightroom Classic. And once you do that, they'll show up over in Lightroom, Lightroom CC if you prefer. Now in Lightroom CC at the top, we have folders, but you're not syncing folders. Below that you have albums, you're syncing the albums. So albums in Lightroom CC are really the same thing as collections in Lightroom Classic. And I wish Adobe just called them the same thing. I don't care if they call them albums or collections, just call them the same. So you're syncing albums with Lightroom Classic when you're in Lightroom CC. And then when you're in Lightroom Classic, you're syncing collections with Lightroom CC. So hopefully that made sense. Now, how do you sync them? Now you can see I have a few synced already. If we go over to Lightroom CC, you can see down here I have birds. It's just 13 bird images. I have one that I just called landscapes. It has one image. And then another is primates and that's 25 images. Well, if we go back to Lightroom Classic, you'll see primates are right here, 25 images. Birds are right here, those 13 images. But, but where are landscapes? I don't see landscapes, right? Well, it depends on where you initiate the sharing from. If you initiate the sharing from Lightroom Classic, as I did primates and birds, it will be just like this. There's primates, there's birds, and they're over here. But if you initiate the sharing from Lightroom CC, like I did this landscape photo that's in the landscape album, then it shows up over here in this collection set from Lightroom. And if we fold that open, there it is. So there's that landscape image that's shared. So I'm in Lightroom Classic right now, and let's just say for the sake of argument, I have this a small collection of five images I called Animals of Forest Lawn. And I want to sync that over to Lightroom CC. To do that, all I need to do, see this little, as I move the cursor to the left, all of a sudden I get this kind of weird double arrow. And you can see that double arrow is on, is on my two sync collections, birds and primates. Well, if I wanted on Animals of Forest Lawn, just click on it. And now it's syncing Animals of Forest Lawn with Lightroom. And if you go over here in the top right hand corner and click on the little cloud, you could see it's syncing the photos. And once it fully syncs, when you go over here, it will show up down here in the album section. And then eventually once it does, you'll see over here, this little cloud, if I click on that, it will be syncing there as well. So not only will it sync there, but it will also sync to any of my mobile devices that I have Lightroom on as well. So I'll be syncing those five images across all those devices. Now, um, typically this does this relatively quickly, but maybe somebody is uh, 
it, I'm not, I'm at home right now and I'm not alone. And some of my family is upstairs and maybe they're uh, streaming something or something like that. So eventually this will show up over here. And actually it did right there, animals of forest lawn. So there they are, they showed up over here. Now, let's say for the sake of argument, I'm in Lightroom CC, or as Adobe says, Lightroom, and I want to sync uh, some images from Lightroom CC over into Lightroom Classic. Well, to do that, let's just go up to all photos here, and let's just say um, that, let's go to grid, and let's just say I want to sync, uh, let's get rid of that, I want to sync gorillas. So I'm going to click on any gorilla images that I see. I'm going to just select a few by holding the command key in on my Mac. So I'm, I'm clicking on a bunch of images of gorillas. All right. So I, I clicked on a bunch and I want to sync all these gorilla images from Lightroom to Lightroom Classic. Now I mentioned you can't sync um, any folders. You have to sync albums. So I'll need to create a new album. So I'll click the little plus sign create album and I'm going to call it gorillas and I'm going to include the eight selected photos the photos I selected and I'll click create now they're here in this album and if I go up to this um, little uh, cloud it's synced them or it's it's syncing them at this moment you can see and then when I go over to Lightroom eventually that um, album I created in Lightroom will show up in this little drop down in or in this collection set from Lightroom. It will show up right here and I'll let it do its thing. It might take, oh, there it is. I get impatient. So it synced and it's in this from Lightroom collection set. And you can see it's right there and there are those images. So that's how you sync uh, images between Lightroom Classic and Lightroom CC. If you don't want to sync anymore, if you're in Lightroom Classic, just undo that little double arrow by clicking on it. So I could click on that and it will undo it and it's going to ask you to stop syncing and it's, um, it's going to be removed from all your devices, but it will stay in Lightroom Classic. Uh, the images themselves will stay here. You're not deleting the images. It just won't show up on your other devices. I'm going to hit cancel. You could do that from here, and then when you're over, oops, why does it do that? I wonder why. Anyway, if you're over here in um, Lightroom or Lightroom CC, and you want to not sync these anymore, you just have to actually delete uh, this. So just delete the album right there, and the images stay. When you delete an album in Lightroom CC, you're not deleting the images. You're just deleting the album. The, the images will stay up here uh, in your folders. So hopefully that made sense. It is kind of confusing because as I mentioned, Adobe doesn't name the same thing in both applications, the same name. It gives them different names. That is albums and collections. And you share things between the two differently. So hopefully that helps you share your images between Lightroom Classic and Lightroom. Thank you everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.